what is up you guys it is your girl elizabeth waters coming back at you with another ed recovery video i know it's been a while since i posted one of these videos but i have been trying to focus a little bit more on mental health um and still really trying to do some research for my black lives matter video that will be coming soon um but yeah i thought that today i would be posting another ed recovery video because your girl has kind of been going through it lately and I know myself and a few other people that have struggled with eating disorders before, whenever they do struggle, but they are recovered, but then like something else comes up, they start to go back to their ways. And I'm not gonna lie, your girl has been going through it, not over it, not under it, through it lately. And um, I haven't like been intentionally going back to like ed thoughts and rules like it just kind of happens um so i just haven't been eating this much this week i've been like having to force myself to eat because i know i need to eat um so today i just wanted to go absolutely all in um and i'm gonna eat everything i'm not this isn't like a binge but i'm going to enjoy what i eat i'm going to you know, if I want ice cream, I'm gonna go get ice cream. I'm not gonna stop myself. And I'm just gonna eat as much as I comfortably can. Cause, um, like it might not be noticeable to other people, but like my clothes feel looser. Um, something that like, I, in my ED, um, my hands get very bony when I'm not eating. Um, my jawline kind of comes back, which like, we can keep her. But, um, it's just like little things. I haven't weighed myself cause I refuse to weigh myself. Um, it's just little things I'm starting to know this and I'm like I really need to start eating so I am going to take you guys along my day with me and we gonna eat lots of food we're starting off with um, coffee and milk and then me and Olivia are going to do a cute little brunch date together so we'll see where that goes okay guys so as I said in the intro me and Olivia are outside eating our lunch hello she look how healthy, look at how healthy am, she is and there's me over here in recovery eating my hibachi chicken that I have left over from three days and you know that coffee I said I was gonna drink this morning um a casualty flew into it <laughs> a fly flew into it so I'm just gonna get coffee later and yeah so that's meal number one for the day meal number two of the day a cream cheese chocolate brownie from I'm recording oh <laughs> A cream cheese chocolate brownie from a local bakery and a caramel latte. Getting those calories in, boys. Alrighty, and for my third meal of the day, I have a small fry, a baconator, and a four piece spicy nugget. Alright, so honesty time. Um, I finished all of that Wendy's for dinner, and then I've had like a few fizzy waters and some ginger ales because my tummy had a lot. But I look like this because me and the girls have been playing Just Dance, having a good time, not thinking about food. And you know, at the beginning of the day, I was really worried about how my stomach looked because I was very, very sunken in. But now I'm like a little bloated. I'm like, I can't suck in too terribly much, so that's really good. Like I can't see my ribs. Um, not that it's a problem if you can see your ribs, like this is just me in my head. Um, yeah, so that's where I'm at and I think I'm done eating for the day. I will check in with you guys tomorrow to talk about I completely forgot the word. Anyway, I'll talk to you tomorrow. Good morning guys. It is the morning after my little relapse experiment. Um, and yeah, I just wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about the whole ED recovery journey. Um, I'm sure you've heard this a million times, but it's not linear. Um, no healing is linear. So sometimes you're going to get in places where you start to sink back into old habits. And I'm not saying that in the past week I've sunk back into my old habits because I haven't. I haven't stepped on a scale. I haven't been calorie counting. I haven't been doing... Um, any any of my old habits but I just noticed the physical changes in my body and like how quickly I was losing weight and that's not okay 
and that's the type of things that you also like need to watch out for um because I'm at a place with my ED where like I'm almost I'm almost all the way like headspace there good um but you know sometimes those physical challenges can come back and I don't want that again I don't want to spend life being like constantly cold even when it's like 90 degrees outside or like my fingertips turning blue like I don't want that um so I I just do little things like this not only to like keep myself healthy and to like make sure I'm not getting back into my old ways, but also to just like show other people that are going through it that like it happens and you'll get through it. Um, yeah, this is the end of my video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Once again, thank you for taking the time out of your day to watch it. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, all the good things, and I will see you guys next time.